Hello guys, uh, this is Encoding Magic YouTube channel today with you and today in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how we can download, install the Hibernate uh, tool in Eclipse. So let me give you brief information what is Hibernate tool. So the Hibernate uh, tool is a Java framework. So basically this is a framework and it simplifies the development of Java application to interact with the database. Uh, it's an open source, lightweight object relational mapping tool. And Hibernate implements the specifications of Java Persistent API. So uh, there are several advantages of this framework. First, it's open source and lightweight and it's fast, fast performance and it's database independent query. Uh, it creates the tables automatically and it simplifies the complex join and it provides query statistics and database status. So uh, guys, uh, to install this one on Eclipse, first you need to have the Java JDK installed in your uh, Windows 10. Uh, go to your CMD uh, command prompt and here let's check whether do I have a no. So let's say Java space hyphen version. Yeah, uh, I have Java version of 15.0.1. Uh, this is in, under my uh, C, uh, C folder. So guys, uh, if you don't have it, please check the description part of this video and I have an video tutorial where I'm gonna show you how we can install Java JDK successfully in our Windows 10. Just link that below in the description part of this video. And next one, next requirement prerequisite is you need to have the any version of uh, Eclipse. If you don't have it, please check the description part of this video and then there is a link and you can click on the link and it will show you the video of how we can uh, download and Eclipse, uh, install the Eclipse on Windows 10. Once you have Java and Eclipse, you are good to go and you come back to, to watch this video. So uh, let me open my Eclipse. I'm in search bar, I type Eclipse and click on my Eclipse uh, icon and it will soon open the Eclipse on my Windows 10. Uh, launch, click on the launcher button here and the Eclipse is launching here. So Eclipse uh, is started on my Windows 10 machine and let me check here. So I don't have any projects and first let us check uh, whether we have Hibernate or not. Go to file and click on new and click on other and let me type hiber Hibernate. So there is no Hibernate uh, tool right now installed in my Eclipse and close this one. And this was just for validation purpose and go to the help option here, click on help and you will see the Eclipse marketplace. This is the uh, marketplace where you can download the Eclipse uh, Java related uh, plugins. Go to the Eclipse marketplace and from here, you need to type uh, JBoss tool. So JBoss tool and click enter or click on run. I'm gonna click on run here. And uh, right now, Eclipse searching for JBoss tool plugin in its marketplace. And soon it's gonna find. And here, as you see, uh, we have couple of results return it and you need to find this one jboss tools for 19.0 final this is then uh, today's latest version but uh, if you're watching this video in the future it may change the version so don't be afraid just uh, you will find this uh, jboss tool and please check the icon icon should be like this uh, and you can read uh, or whatever here in description part and you will see that it was downloaded 1.2 million times in its history and the, only for the last month it was downloaded 
more than 10,000 times in Eclipse. So this is a very, very popular uh, Java framework for the backend. Uh, so, and here uh, you will see the install button here. So click on the install button and you need to wait a little while the Eclipse is resolving and fetching the data. And here, as you see, the JBoss tool has a lot of options here. And the, it's the huge one. From out of here, you need to select only, only Hibernate tools. So you need to deselect all of these tools because we don't really need, we only need here the Hibernate tool. So if you have done, if you have selected all of them, uh, just make sure that to first unselect all and here uh, you don't have to unselect e uh, one by one for each of those just if you click this the main one the main parent one it can select or unselect so I'm unselecting and here you will see hibernate tool option and click on this one select all the hibernate if you can see I, de I have deselected all these options only I have selected Hibernate tools and confirm here and Eclipse is calculating requirements and it's uh, calculating its dependencies also uh, soon or it I will gonna install the Hibernate uh, tool in our Eclipse machine so here it's asking for uh accepting our the license agreements you can read these license agreements if you want uh so basically i have read it uh i have read it uh uh in the past so i don't have to read it right now and just click select the i accept the terms of the license agreement and click on finish button here and as you can see the stats of installation it is right now 9%, it's 26%, and you need to wait until the uh, 100%. And the installation is still going on. Be patient, and soon later you're gonna create the project with Hibernate tool, and you can use Hibernate for your backend needs. So guys, the installation have completed here, and the Eclipse is asking to restart the Eclipse uh, ID uh, to make sure that all changes uh, took effect. Uh, so here, uh, what it says, installing signed unsigned software for which other, oh, okay, this is a different one. So just say install anywhere, anyway. So we are sure that this, uh, this plugin is valid and it doesn't, uh, have risk in to our Windows 10 so here right now I'm gonna restart now click on restart now so Eclipse automatically will restart on Windows 10 and the changes will be activated and we're gonna validate uh, once uh, Eclipse uh, opens in our Windows 10 machine uh, so guys Eclipse is open right now and it's active so this is the pop-up uh, window it's asking for will you allow jboss tool team to receive anonymous for this eclipse instance for jboss tool i say no no don't share my information with anyone this is the privacy man why jboss is asking for this one i'm not sure so preferable preferably i uh, prefer not to share information so here let's check uh, validate whether jboss is active or not click on file and click on new and here you will see the other option click on the other option and here in the wizards uh, search for hibernate I, wow yeah can you see this one hibernate and we have the hibernate configuration file hibernate console configuration hibernate reverse engineering everything the hibernate right now is ready to be used guys go ahead create the projects use the hibernate and enjoy your life if you like my video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share this with your friends
I really appreciate your time. And if you have any questions, please comment down under this video and I will be more than happy to answer you. Thank you very much.